you're never leaving. You got that. You have gotten the beautiful words of you're never leaving. New Horizons. I'm not even gonna say the date because I, I kind of forgot. Day 38. <laughs> Day 38. I was actually supposed to be up at 6 a.m. to try to fish and catch bugs and then sell it all at 8 a.m. for Timmy and Tommy so I can get money for turnips. But um, right now it's 8:34 a.m. on Sunday, I, April 26, 2020. Obviously that didn't happen. I decided to sleep in and go shower around like 7ish. Now for today's announcement, the new art gallery. Oh shit! The new art gallery at the museum is open as of today. It's a wonderful gallery with space for painting, sculptures, and more. The museum's intrepid curator, Blathers, accepts art donations all day, every day. But if you'd like to make a donation, please be mindful that there is fake artwork circling out there. As always, use your best judgment. And of course, we'll be holding a special ceremony to celebrate the happy news. If you're interested in participating, have time, please check in with Tom Nook, Tom Nook, our resident services. That's all for now. I hope you all enjoyed the loveliest of lovely days. Thank you, Isabel. She's so cute. So last night, I did get some mail and I decided to check them already. So if you don't see your gift here, hello, Zucker. Zucker didn't give me a gift for my Happy Home Academy thingy. Um, if, if you don't see a gift here from you, it's because I opened it last night. But we're gonna check on the- oh shit, I was gonna say check on it later. Were you wearing clothes backwards the other day? Or were you walking backwards? Either way, it was real neat, man. Real neat, Zucker. Oh, it was- it's just a regular letter, which I hardly get from them. I was gonna say I'll check this later, but we might as well check it now. 132,000 points, yo. Thanks. Nook Academy, I meant Home Academy, I'm not remembering anything anymore. Oh, and last night I fucked up and didn't request KK Slider correctly. I thought I hit the right one, but I hit the request by mood. So I ended up getting KK Calypso or something along those lines. So I'm very sad that I fucked up on that. Don't I already have this trophy? And then I ordered another sewing machine, a uh, red one, because I realized I did give Tyler a red one, and then I was looking at it, and I was like, it's kind of cute. And then this is just the two things that Tyler lets me pick out. And then I believe, well, it's literal blank. <laughs> I didn't know you could make a literally blank letter. I'm pretty sure that's the blue sewing machine that he had that I didn't have the color of, and it's super, super cute. I'm gonna keep everything on me though, because I'm gonna just like throw it out in the house. Look how cute it is! Oh, you can't turn it on? What? Oh, makes sense. Turn it off in the front. <laughs> it's not like my AC, my outdoor AC, where I can turn it on and off in, in the back. This gift is from Cherry Sunshine, Lollipops, and Rainbows. Oh, what is. Is this a song? <gasps> Rainbow Umbrella! How cute! This is super, super, super cute. Thank you, Cherry. And then, Amelia. Okay, done with the gifts now. So, Amelia gave me a bunch of gifts last night. Um, I don't remember what they were, but I did get them. <laughs> and I either put it in the storage or I hung it outside. <gasps> this is so cute! Maybe we'll wear this today. I've never seen this before. Let's wear this dress today. I gotta, uh, that means I have to just change my outfit, like, right now. Uh, shiny new gift two days ago. Is this a song? I didn't know my brother would- What? Another gift from Amelia? Did, was I blind? I just didn't notice that she got me something else. Okay, this is for my brother. It's a music. I wonder what song that is. I never heard of it. Peach Stripes Rock. <gasps> I wanted this! It was on my wish list. Thank you, Amelia. Night, night. <laughs> Motherfucker. Night night, motherfucker. Ee, <laughs> a hi. I don't know what that means. Okay. What is this night night? <laughs> night night, motherfucker. <laughs> Sleeping bag. <laughs> I don't want this. Why did he give this to me? <laughs> a red windflower. I guess he was just. I guess my brother was trying to give me gifts. That's probably what it was. 
Um, obviously, you guys still see the flowers up top on the cliffs. I didn't have time to move them. I just got on last night to clean up everything, and then um, I did. I did get something. I got enough money. I got enough money to get me a synthesizer. Synthesizer? Pretty cool. This is my house right now. It's a complete mess. I changed into a super cute outfit. It's Sunday, uh, chill outfit. Girl woke up real, real late, obviously, today, because I was supposed to wake up at six, so my face is all covered with rice. Stuffed my face with rice quickly in the morning and ran out of the house. So that's the look for today. Super, super cute. Um, let's collect these things here. Oh, Bingo's in her house. Let's go say hi to her. Oh, and message and bottle. Trying to make as much money as we can. I should catch that fish too. Hello, sir. Do you want to bite on the bobber? Oh my god. I need to close my eyes whenever I start fishing again. Sometimes I feel like I could do it with my eyes open. Obviously, that did not happen. Bangle's sick! What's wrong? Everyone has gro grody days, but you're never ready for your turn. I should have bought some medicine. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will give you some medicine, Bangle. Don't worry, Bangle. I got you. Here, go. Have some medicine. Bangle's gotten sick, sick two times since we met her. I want to go out because I'm starting to feel less gross, but I definitely should, should get some more rest. I want to thank you, so here's a com comedian's outfit. You and Maple. You think I'm a comedian? <laughs> I'm not a comedian. See you later, Ringo. Hope we get better. I would give this to. Oh, 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 oh. oh. I forgot to talk, talk about what happened last night. Last night. Last night, oh shit. Apparently I don't know how to use my keys anymore. My buttons. Because <laughs> I'm confusing it with the PlayStation buttons. But last night, Frida over here was making an item. And I was really debating whether I wanted to talk to her or not. But I decided to talk to her because she gave me a recipe I didn't learn yet, which is a wooden table mirror. So everybody has been spoken to. And I quickly shot this photo right here. I don't know what time it was. I think it was like 9 or 10 that I finally got a cute shot like this. I wish my character was turned a little to face the fountain a little bit more. But I was too like in a rush to take the photo. So I didn't have time. And then Tyler's Place was selling this cool jacuzzi. And I didn't have the money for it because today, like last night I was trying to save as much money for turnips to get the the better like amount and i think last week i still had more than this week so this week only had like 67k but that's not accounting for like high start uh me selling stuff because i still have some seashells on me uh, let's catch this bug i'm sure it costs like nothing but like come here shit no 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 don't sacrifice yourself okay oh there she is there's daisy may i just gotta see how much she's selling her Turnips for. It's been notorious for selling it to us for over like a hundred. Hey, Daisy May. Good morning. You here to set your Sunday off with some fresh turnips? I got dessert. Ninety-four bells. Okay, it's actually one cheap, one, one bell cheaper than Luis's. So I might just end up selling here, but I gotta check with Tyler's Daisy May and see how much she's selling. For. She's, she's selling it for. It's like a fucking tongue twister out here. <laughs> Uh, I shook all my trees to make money last night. Oh, let's see what's up there. in here. Oh, Maple's in here too! Oh, what are you cuties doing in here? Wait, all the cuties in this room. Hey, I'm just chilling with Maple. What's the latest? Wow, it feels like a birthday party. It's a regular party with everyone over like this. So nice that we could all be here together like this. Let's talk. No, I see why Zucker is always so relaxed. His home is just so comfortable. Maybe that's because I get along so well with Zucker. <gasps> Another love story? Is there a love strangle going on? Between Nate... I'm kidding. But these two are actually cute together. You guys are so cute. Wait, I want to take a picture. I'm going to be a paparazzi and pretend that this is a love story going on. In, ac in actuality, there's nothing going on but friends. Friendship! <laughs> They're in love. Look at her. They're in love. Bye guys! They're so cute together!
me pretending to make like <laughs> love stories in this in this game. Okay, anyway, uh, ooh, what the fuck, Red? What are you doing up there, dude? I don't know if you see him. He's up there. What is he doing up here? He's not in this boat. Hey, it's kind of weird because he's in like all oh, surrounded by trees and everything, being shady. I know that shiny face anywhere. How you been, Michiko? You made the right choice buying that art from me earlier. I've had a lot of folks asking about it. Uh, you know, I really gotta be honest. I think I'm falling for Kari. I mean, you've got quite a setup going here and a lot of art fans. So Kari wants art and I got art to sell. Might be something like something to this, but I couldn't sell to just anybody. I need someone I could trust completely as if they were family. And since we're basically cousins and because I know you've got an eye for quality, I want to see you. Wanna look at a few things? I've got both art and furniture. Plus you'd get my cousin discount in. Uh, seems kinda sketchy. I'm hurt! There's nothing sketchy about this, I can prove it. I've got my boat anchored off the northern shore and I'm almost done fixing all the leaks. Long story. Come have a look at what I'm selling, you won't regret it. Wait, I wanted to take a photo of you in the shady forest! Damn it! Damn it, that would've been a good photo. Cause he's so shady. In my shady forest. Damn it. Shouldn't have talked to him, god damn it. It would've been a nice photo, it's okay. <laughs> Zucker and um, Maple will be a great thumbnail. <sighs> oh. Oh, I didn't even read this uh, DIY real quick. What time is it? Nine o'clock. Here's a secret, and I secreted it. I found a recipe in an old dinosaur book I didn't know I still had. That dino's gotta be, a re be real mad by now. I thought it smelled good, so I wanna share that smell with you. It may if you make it scream, I made it! By Mo Lismarca. Bone door plate. <gasps> Tyler actually wanted these, but he got them as a gift already. But I have the recipe now for a door plate. Oh, I don't have any dogs in this, in my village, in my island to give one away. Aww. But I, at least I got it now. I can make it. All right, let's go sell. Oh, Nate, were you the one sneezing? Oh, no, it's Daisy made it sneezing. She's, she's walking. Okay. Let me go quickly sell my stuff. 79k. So I'm BRB and um, go check Tyler's switch real quick. So I checked Tyler's prices and his prices are 95 bells. So technically mine's the cheapest by one bell amount. So I'm going to open my gates and then control his animal crossing over to my place so I can let him buy it. Tyler has landed, but I have no idea where the fuck Daisy Mae is. So, <laughs> oh, there she is. All right, let me buy from her first. Hi, Daisy Mae. 94 bells each, yep, I'll buy some. I have 79K, so buy the max. 840, I need more. Yeah, I'll buy them. There we go. Thank you. I think I could buy more. Can I? I don't know. Um, the character's moving on her own. <laughs> Let me go... Grab this. Why is my character moving on its own? Hello? Oh my god, my thing is drifting. My Joy-Con's drifting. Because I'm holding on to Tyler's Switch right now. All right, he- Oh my god, character, stop moving, Jesus, you're scaring me. I'm just gonna- Okay, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm physically not moving that. This Casper is moving it. Buy the max for Tyler. Oh shit, his inventory is full. He could buy more. But his inventory is full. Oh my god! Oh my god, my joy con's drifting. <laughs> it's drifting, because I'm physically right here, <laughs> Man, Tyler's gonna be rich. I'm so jelly. Alright, well, I don't know how... Shit, let me, uh, control my character. This is all the ones that I had to drop down. I accidentally picked one up, but this isn't even all of it. <laughs> I have to do multiple trips back. I finished doing stuff for Tyler. <laughs> My measly amount compared to his. It's not 
not even funny. I'm so, so fucking sad. Um, I guess maybe today we'll just try to... I don't have that much to show you guys. I don't even have a lot of money. <laughs> I was gonna actually go make more money. What are you guys doing over there? Make more money to get more turnips. <laughs> So I'm probably just gonna catch a bunch of bugs and collect some seashells. Sea seashells. So today's episode might be really short because I don't want to bore you guys with that stuff. <gasps> so cute! We kind of trapped Julia though, Nate. Yay! Are you out for a walk? I want to chat. Calorie's the perfect size. Too big to see across, but too small for a sea monster to attack. I wish he wouldn't say the same stuff all over again, but it's okay, I guess. <laughs> Um, we also gotta move a villager today, so I gotta do that. Um, let's go throw my turnip somewhere. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's Michiko! What's the latest? I'm just walking around the island, you know, getting my face out there, building my brand, being famous, you know, the huge. <laughs> uh, let's drop all my turnips here. We gotta celebrate our, um, museum because I just realized it looks totally fucking different. And I walked by it this morning, like, not caring, like, la 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 la, didn't even fucking notice that it changed. <laughs> Look at it. It's so fucking beautiful now. Wow. Holy shit. That's pretty cool. Wait, I want to take a picture with it. First, let's go celebrate. Let's go celebrate. Catch some bugs, because I'm pretty sure there maybe might be clothes I want. Maybe, maybe, well, maybe let's celebrate first and then see if there's any clothes we want. Nothing in here. What's in here? Two days ago. Yo, right. <laughs> my brother got me this and then I end up having it in my thing. Now then, I'd like to begin our special ceremony celebrating the Grand Museum of our fancy new museum. It does look fancy. I love it. Thank you. As I'm sure you've all noticed, Kyra has gone through marvelous, wondrous changes. It's all thanks to the fun residents of this island who work together daily. Yes, yes, you have my thanks. I'd like to ask Blathers to say a few words as a representative from our newly remodeled museum. Blathers, if you would, just like, um, a word or two? Indeed, I should keep this brief. Ahem, <clears throat> dearest residents of Kari, it is an honor and a pleasure to- is, Did Tom Nook just, like, shoot him for, like, not shoot him, like, literally, but, like, Low-key dissed him for talking too much. <laughs> it's an honor and a pleasure to take this moment to thank you for your continued support of the museum. That must be said, I have received donations at a faster pace than I ever imagined possible. Stunning, humbling, at times overwhelming. Your gifts of fossils, fish, and bugs have not only made our museum a cultural marvel, they have, I was like, but, they have made my spirit soar. Hootie hoo, tis true. And now we have opened a new edition, one I have dreamt of since I was but an owl wet. Yes, a proper art gallery, one in which we shall display proper art, painting, statues, proper art. By Jove, my cultural- Oh, I need money for fucking art from Red. And cure it all dreams have come true. Who and hooray. I beg your pardon, my enthusiasm has been running at the back. Beak, sorry, once again. To the point then, as we celebrate this new wing of the museum, I feel I must entreat you. Please continue to donate your acquisitions. I ask this not just for the b b betterment of the museum, but for the betterment of us all. Who and thank you. Two or three words, you know. Just two or three words. <laughs> uh, yes, I mean, no, Tom, no, you're so rude. No, thank you. Glad there's for the, those many, many, many words of wisdom. Next, a few words from some a few, he was like, a few words from someone whose valuable contributions made this remodel possible. Of course, I mean Michiko, our resident representative. Hmm? Michiko, anything to add? Uh, good rest. I look so goofy. Yes, yes, indeed. Thank you for your very, your heartfelt and encouraging sentiments there, Michiko. Everyone, please get ready to join me in bringing the ceremony to a close. Gonna catch me this time saying it. <laughs> Pop. Aww. Sterling in the in the shirt I got him always. It's so cute and maple. Thank you all. This concludes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. Nice. Now let's go look in the museum. <laughs> I am pleased to say that our exhibit is finally finished. Your very own donations made all possible, Michiko. So to you, I am most grateful. The entrance to the gallery is, is but a jaunt up the stairs. Please, do take a gander at your leisure. Let's go look at the painting. Appa Ooh, I saw leaves falling. <laughs> Apparently, when these paintings opened their eyes... I don't know if that was an edit or not. That shit scared me. Oh, this is the painting. Oh, perfect painting. Apples and oranges. Paul... S Suzanne? 
circa 1899 oil on canvas. This still life is known to have inspired the work of many other artists, including Pablo Picasso. Rather than trying to recreate an image, Cezanne, I don't know, captured the beauty of shapes from many angles. With this work, don't know if I'm pronouncing their name right, Cezanne draws on both the atmosphere of his subjects and the spirit of its beholders. I love fucking art. Like, it's so beautiful. And this is probably the only place I'll actually want to read the information on it. Sorry, bugs. Sorry, fish. Sorry, fossils. Art has stolen my hair. I miss going to art galleries. It's been forever since I went to one. And it's not possible to go to one right now either. Oh, look at the... See the leaves? So pretty. I don't know where they could possibly put... Brewster, if he does come. I feel like they might give him his own coffee shop, which I'm hoping so. Because if so, it would be right here. I have lots of empty plots right here. Right here would be his coffee shop, just in case I'm leaving this spot open. <laughs> um, I might make a playground over here. I know I wanted to do like a playground amusement park up there, but I might just do an amusement park up there with the teddy bear tea um, idea you guys gave me. So I might make a park... Huh? What? Hello? I got something for you, a pom-pom sweater! Oh, motherfucker. <laughs> I just thought he wanted to move out. I found a bunch of these when I was cleaning house last night. I'm kind of superstitious about stuff like this, so enjoy. Hopefully they aren't haunted or anything. Don't tell me that, Sterling. What the heck? Pom-pom sweater. I'm pretty sure... <gasps> this is so fucking cute. I was, I'm pretty sure this was on my wish list, but I don't remember seeing something like this. I'm keeping it. It's really cute. I love it. Thank you, Sterling. I'm never... You're never leaving. You got that. You have gotten the beautiful words of you're never leaving. <laughs> um, I might make a playground right here. Like this whole area playground. Because I don't think... I can't think of any other shops they might put. I feel like a uh, leaf would probably be with Timmy and Tommy in a future upgrade, maybe. Like the older games. Like new new leaf. And hopefully kicks. Well, kicks and new leaf had his own shop. So if he had his own shop, that's where I'm running into trouble. Cause I don't have space for it. Maybe I'll keep his shop up here. And then I'll do a playground right here. Just between these lines. I'll, maybe I'll plot it down today. The little um, pathways. It's gonna be a small park though, so I'm sad. I want it to be a big park. Because that's one thing I look forward to whenever we like look around neighborhoods and stuff. I always make sure to see if they have a playground for kids. Because I feel like that's something kids enjoy, you know? A playground. And if there's no playground, I feel kind of sad. <laughs> Maybe because when I was younger, um, when I lived in the apartments, the, there was like two two playgrounds. So I felt very spoiled. And I really enjoyed that because that's where I spent most of my time. I don't know what kids do nowadays. Maybe stay inside and stuff. But I still feel like there should be a playground for, you know, the younger generation to enjoy and have fun at. But that's just me. Now I sound like an old fart. <laughs> Hopefully there's nothing I want in here. Even though there's like a barista outfit. Uh, have you met our si other sister label yet? She comes to the island from time to time. She's got big dreams, sometimes too big if you know what I mean, but I think you'll like her. She can be a little shy around strangers, but I know that's not a problem for you. Oh, that means I've collected all her patterns because she hasn't given me anymore. Alright, so I don't have to feel bad for missing a day or two. Oh, this cafe uniform. I think I got this one though from label. Uh, yesterday I bought a same outfit and I use Tyler's Taylor tickets and I cringe every time I think about it. And I'm so sad yet. <laughs> I'm so sad I did that. Oh! Tyler was mad I didn't tell him I had safety helmets the other episode. I have him again, so I will tell him <laughs> today that I have him here. Ooh, triangle shades. I bought one yesterday. I think I bought this one. Uh oh. I thought it was pink. It looked pink from where I was standing. Toppy. Oh, I need these. I need these. There's like, they're super cute. Oh, I need them. Uh oh. Okay, so shit. Too, too bad I used a totally ticket yesterday on something I didn't need. Um, something did catch me. I'm just too broke. <laughs> Maybe I'll come back. I'm just too broke right now. Literally can't buy anything. Ugh, 
That money tree is very tempting, but I don't want to. I picked a new place for Ketchup's home. I sure hope she likes it, because that's where she's gonna be. Uh, who's this, Mira? Oh, Sterling's in her spot. All right, well, tomorrow I'm going to be moving Lopez down. So that way, uh, he won't be uh, in between Zucker and Sterling's spot. But I have 10k on me, so we're gonna go see red. And then I'm going to lay out the playground-ish area, kind of. It's kind of, it's really bad that we don't know if there's going to be any more future stores and such. Because like everyone's already laying out their land. And then if we find out there's a new store, we all have to like readjust our land <laughs> to, to accom uh, accommodate it. So I'm just gonna leave a spot there just in case if Kix has his own store. Cause I'm praying Leaf would just move in with um, Timmy and Tommy and I already have a spot for Brewster. So, hey Red, I got 10K, ooh. <laughs> I mean, Chico, I'm so glad you made it. So here's a pitch, ready? I, I say, ugh, because of the one painting. And then the other painting is the one where the lady's eyes open and close. But I'm pretty sure that was just a meme and someone just did it on purpose. So here's a pitch, ready? At Jolly Red's Treasure Trawler, we sell only the finest. And there's nothing finer than fine art and rare furniture, am I right? Of course, I can't let all these fine things just walk out the door. I gotta limit you to one piece of art per day. It's a hassle, I know, but I hope the cousin's discount will make up for it. Plus, I'll let you buy all the furniture you want, no questions asked so take a look around we've got masterpieces by the great masters plus stuff for your master bedroom let me know if you have any questions okay so he has a red mini fridge and a scooter i don't know if your friends can come in here or not uh hopefully they can because i'm pretty sure ty will like both of these things i'm just fucking broke so i can't buy them for him um i'm pretty is it it was this painting here where her eyes I won't lie, an awful lot of folks uh, have been asking me about buying the wistful painting there. But maybe the price scared them off, so I'll send, sell it for you. Uh, I want a closer look. Her eyes aren't gonna open and close, right? That'd be fucking creepy. I don't know if this is legit. Um, I need to pull up a guide. <laughs> sure there's a guidebook. Guys, tell me if her eyes open and close. I don't want to look, so you guys can look for me. <laughs> the real one has a pearl earring, so this is fake. This person here has to be holding a meerkat. Now let's see. A serene painting. I want a closer look. It has to have like a pure white. Okay, this is fake. No, bitch. You're not selling me some fake shit! So this one looks like a fake. Okay, it doesn't have a sprout on his chest, so it's fake. So this one right here is the real one. There's always guaranteed one real one. So this is the real one. It has to be. Let me double check on it, though. Wait, what? Are these all fake? The real one hat will be missing... The fake version of the painting will be missing trees in the top right corner it's missing a tree in the top right corner yo are all these fake usually like there will be at least one real one but all these are fake holy shit all these are fake <laughs> I all these are fake cause this one doesn't have a sprout fake this one doesn't have a top right fake that goose, oh, just a beach. This goose here, meerkat is a, it's not even meerkat, it's a goosey thingy. And this one doesn't have pearl earrings. She had star earrings, right? Let me see. I was too scared to look at her. Let me see again. Let me see. Yeah, that's a star earring. The real version has a pearl earring shocker. The fake version has star shape. These are all fake. Wow. So, okay. Usually in the order games, there was one guaranteed to be real. But these are all fucking 
feet. Bye, bitch. <laughs> Get me out of here. Oh. Thanks. Yeah, you ain't scamming me. Literally. All of them were fake. How rude of him. How rude. It's okay. More money in my pocket, so I don't care. But let's go uh, lay out the playground now. See, I have so much stuff for the playground, though. So I'm very worried I won't have enough space. But I do want to do the whole amusement park tea bear party situation. Because you guys gave me such a great idea to do a teddy bear tea area. Because I have so many bears. <laughs> so I thought that was the smartest idea. And this is for the playground, too. Where am I going? By the way. Oh, I got mail? Hello? Oh, Mello! A cute tool to make cute clothes. Oh! <gasps> Is it a sewing machine? I don't know why I wouldn't collect all the colors now. <laughs> sewing machine! Yes! It's another pink one. I will definitely put this somewhere. Thank you so much, Mello. It's so fucking cute. Gotcha. Hey, I heard, you know, totally everyone is calling you subscribe. Okay. I thought she was about to move. So, it's been the last time I think, I believe Cranston moved out April 9th. So we're nearing the whole 15 days of uh, someone moving out. So I'm pretty sure somewhere this week another villager should be asking to move out. And I'm hoping it's either Frida, Mira, or Julia. Because we're nearing that time of them asking to move out. Um, this line here is to, to show me that this is where the feature kick store would be. I would probably have to put it like, right here, though. Like, right next to the plaza, which I don't like too much. Because the museum has a good amount away from the plaza. But the kickstore wouldn't. Maybe I'll just put him in the corner right here. On this side? I don't know. That's if he even has a store. I don't know why I'm planning stores that aren't even here yet. But, there's a spot for that.
Alright, so I think the playground is done for now. Um, there's not a lot of stuff. It, it kind of looks like a lot, though. <laughs> it, it, there's, there's not that many things in this park. It's a shit ton of things to do in this park right here. Um, I'm gonna need multiple more tires, so... I gotta do some fishing. I'm mad that I sold a lot of tires because I didn't think I, I would need them. But I kind of need them because I want to line them up against this area here. Like, this whole area would be just tires, maybe? But then the park wouldn't be really accessible. It's just for looks because you wouldn't be able to move around like I am right here. So the park would just be for looks. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to like actually move around in here, I don't think. Because once I put uh, the fences on this side, I don't think it would be able to move. Hmm. Um, let me. I kind of want you to move around in it though. So I'm gonna extend this a little bit out here. It's kind of a tight squeeze. Um, this blue elephant here might not stay because there's the other elephant slides that I am still looking out for. Um, I do want to collect all the colors. So this one might be put into the amusement park. So whatever I didn't use for my park is gonna be in the amusement park. Um, I was doing this so I can like scatter this with flowers. Cause this is gonna be like a man-made like land to be here type of thing. Or am I not do it? I don't know. I don't know. Hello? I got distracted looking at me. Is he gonna sit on the bench? Oh, he is so fucking cute. Color block dress shirt. Oh, mm, no, thank you. I've been slowly collecting money. Um, I gotta get flowers to put out here. Uh, I might do a little bit of like dropping some cute patterns here and there, like sparkles. Cute. I don't know how many bubblegum machines there are, so I might change this if there's not that many. There's some sparkle here. Um, this area is for you to park your bike or scooter or however the hell you got to the park. I thought this was a cute idea, so I gotta check what other um, riding stuff there are. I might need another bike and another scooter. Well, how about that? Seeing your face made me forget all my worries. Well, she ran over here to just tell me that? Oh, that's kind of cute. <laughs> I was like, wait, what's wrong with her? Right, I think I'm for sure done now. I threw some flowers everywhere. Almost everywhere. Not everywhere, everywhere. Um, just temporarily now. Just thrown in certain areas. I might come back later today and... Um, Sprinkle out some more flowers and such. This area though... But, okay. Um, this area though is kind of bare just because, you know, I'm assuming that there might be a cafe coming out. I might have to plot out a little section, like right here. Um, a pathway out here to... Let me do that right now. <laughs> Before like just talking about it. Let me just like put a pathway out here.
You got a surprise for me, Prezi. A hat? What is this? Student cap. Oh, for graduation? Pretty awesome, huh? But you know, if it's not your thing, no big. I think it's the graduation one. So I was trying to make a... Uh, I don't know what the fuck I was making, to be honest. So this is gonna be like the cafe, if there is a cafe area. Um... I don't know what I was trying to... <laughs> I wanted to make this place look cool, but it might not look cool. I don't know. I, I have no idea. Um, if I like this or not. This is gonna be where flowers are and then, like, uh, water to break it apart. Then it leads you to the higher end district, I guess. Like, the museum is pretty fancy. And then this would be where the cafe would play. If we are getting a cafe. Um, I don't know what to do with the outsides. Maybe it's like tables or something right here. Like, maybe a table here or something. I don't know. Hmm. Maybe I should also... Do I have space for another one to like sit right here? I don't know. I think two might be enough. Hmm. Hmm. I really don't know what I'm doing. I'm just like putting things down as I go. And maybe things, it will look good when I toss flowers out or something. <laughs> I have no idea. Uh, I don't know. At least we got a road layout for future cafe and future maybe kick store or a store of some sort. At least the park's beautifully done. Not really. I uh, just gotta get more of the elephant slides. I'm hoping they sell the colors that I want. I'm looking for a white, purplish one, like a white pinky one. And then there's like the purplish one and then there's a the yellow slide. I don't know how many slide colors there are. I gotta look up the bumblebee machines and see if we have any more of those. But things are coming together. I might just have to find some furniture to put out here. I don't know what to put out here. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna keep this. So if you see in tomorrow's episode that I scrapped it, you'll know why. I think I'll, I'll like it better once I see flowers down. Same thing with um, over there with the bench situation over here. Once I see the flowers down, I'll probably like it a little better. And then I'll probably sprinkle around some more of these floral cuteness stuff. But things are looking nice. They're looking pretty nice. I played this game way too long today, so I'm gonna hurry up and wrap things up. Today's post says we made a cute playground today. Nate seems to enjoy it. And those are supposed to be elephant slides, by the way, but they kind of look like not elephant slides. <laughs> But I believe we talked to everyone but Lopez. I remember that if you got butterfly, I need to catch that. I need to catch that. Gimme, gimme. Nice. I hope Leaf comes back pretty soon so I can buy some more bushes. Because I think that's what I'm lacking. I'm um, using a lot of flowers and such, but I feel like some bushes would be nice here and there. Oh, uh, I put this here. The public bench. Because why not? I thought I saw a snack machine, so I was like, mm, you know, maybe someone would like to rest a little bit over here by the street light. It's safe right here. <laughs> it's safe here. Let me push this back. I don't like that. Like, it's half on the dirt and half on the concrete. But it looks better right here. Hmm. Should I put it maybe like facing this way instead? Oh, I'm trying to push it. Maybe I can't push it anymore. Nope, okay. Mm -hmm. oh, my inventory getting full. Patchwork coat. Oh, literally a patchwork coat. Okay, uh, it's almost 11, so let me go sell some stuff and see if I can <laughs> buy any turnips. Because I think we did a lot today. Uh, I feel like we did a lot today. <laughs> we moved people. We made a playground. Uh, gotta buy turnips. I have one more hour to make money. Quick money to make some turnips. Oh, I'm so far off from the camera. Oh, he's making something. I mean, Chico, welcome to the house of Lopez. What you doing? Glad you asked. Right now, I'm making a wonderful wooden double bed. I got the idea of making it from a crazy dream I had the other night. Oh, I don't have it? Yeah. Gimme, gimme. Uh-oh, I've already forgotten my dream, but I have the recipe written down right here. 
Gimme, gimme, gimme. I'm pretty sure this looks really, really cute. Like, I saw someone, uh, change the fabric on it, I believe. Like, colored it. And it looks really adorable. Good thing we came to see Lopez. <laughs> oh, it is super cute. Oh, well, 30 wood. Holy shit, a whole fucking stack. Oh, what do you even do to these things? What is it? Weave flowers to craft a wreath. Oh, are you shitting me? That's a lot. Oh, I got a meal. All for my brother. Uh, he spelled Asian wrong. <laughs> Unless he did that on purpose. Asian. There we go. <laughs> Let's see. What did he get me? Aodai? 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 Oh my god! Isn't this like the, the Vietnamese dress? That towel wrap? Oh yo! I needed this! Thanks, brother. Pretty sure this is the Vietnamese dress that I wear when I was younger. I didn't know they had it in this game. Oh, I gotta tell my brother, thank you. Oh, here we go. Orange one flower, red one flower, and red, white one flower. So I do have the, the recipes for it. Let's craft this beautiful wreath. I guess I'll mail my brother this one. Because <laughs> I don't think he has it. I think. Oh, do, do I even have? I don't know if I mailed him two things today. Okay, well, I'll go mail that to my brother in a second. Um, we're gonna call it an episode, because it's been very, very long since I played Animal Crossing. I think at least four hours or so, maybe eight, what, nine, ten, okay, maybe three hours. Feels like four hours, because we did so much today. <laughs> but anyway, hope you guys are liking how, um, the island is starting to shape up. I'm getting very excited because things are happening, guys. Things are happening and it looks so beautiful. Uh, I don't know what flowers to throw in that little patch area. I like to mix a bunch of different flowers and use different flowers for, for certain spots. I'm trying to use every single kind besides pansies because screw pansies. Sorry if you guys do like pansies. I don't know how to this. But um, I'm going to figure it out. It's going to look nice tomorrow. You'll see um, the progress. Hopefully I get more tires. When I go fishing. Can't believe I keep constantly throwing them out when I need them. So I'm going to tell Louise and Tyler as well if they catch some tires to just leave it for me. So I can come to their island and pick it up. But anyway, thank you guys for watching today's episode. Stay beautiful and I'll see you guys in the next one.